Hello, the internet. I didn't upload it last week. I actually filmed it and edited it, and I just didn't get around to, film, uh, to uploading. Uh, again, I did well at the beginning of the week. Nothing. Nothing in the second half of the week. So I'm going to try something new yet again. I'm going to do my week cover. I'm going to do my brain dump. And then I'm going to do a whole page per day. Also, it's my birthday this week on Sunday. So that's fun. Right. I'm going to get started and I will see you in the voiceover. Hello again, it's me. I'm now in the voiceovers. Um, I had no plan, as always, coming into the week. So, that's pretty much it. It's my birthday on Sunday. I don't have any plans. We're going bowling, actually, on Friday night uh, with the gym lot. With the gym, they organise a big social so we're going um, and then I'm going to commandeer that and take some party hats and make everybody pretend that it's my birthday party and we're all 12 again I'm not going to say how old I'm going to be but it's too old to have a candle for every year so uh, I'm using the Crayola pastel pens that Michael got me for Valentine's Day instead of flowers, which I greatly appreciate. Um, oh, I, okay, I guess a bit of, like, admin. I'm working in a Scribbles That Matter notebook. It's, I think it's the 90 GSM paper, which isn't great for ghosting. You can see already from the week before that there's some, like, ghosting showing through. But considering how thin the paper is, like it's pretty good um the a6 journal is not a size that i get on with in fact is it a6 i think it might be b6 i don't remember these things um i think it's b6 it's just not a size that i get on with it's not quite big enough to be able to do like multiple things per page comfortably but it's also not small enough that I feel comfortable doing one thing so this this week doing one page per day is it's, I just it feels like a waste of paper like I don't need that much space but maybe I do need that much space maybe the fact that I've not been using it is because actually it's not giving me space to think um I am blocking in all of the colours. Oh, I just saw my niece cycle past. Um, I'm blocking in some time blocks with for like fixed appointment stuff that I know is going to happen. And then I think that for the rest of the sort of time blocking, I just, I'm like big picture stuff. I did find that having just the three time blocks, just the morning, afternoon and evening worked quite well for me. But then when I had like specific appointments or appointments that like were shorter or spanned or cut into across the two blocks, it sort of like muddled me a bit. Um, I also, this is the first time that I've actually sat down for a significant period of time. I'm cutting, I've cut out all of the periods when I was just staring out the window thinking but it's the first time that I actually went and used the brain dump properly to like not be like oh okay what do I need to do in the week but just like what are the things that are occupying brain space so we'll see if that's useful or not I actually have a journal that I'm working with a friend on black paper which is an astrology themed journal which is due to start in March and I I haven't finished it anywhere near so that's sort of like vaguely a top priority because I need to finish it and send it to her 
before the 21st of March, which is when Taurus begins, Taurus being the first sign in the yearly zodiac. Eep boop. That's pretty much it. I planned some stuff. I think it was helpful actually. But anyway. If you stuck it up, bye. Uh, bye.